Let's take a look at the results. First, 85% of those who thought they were alone and heard choking tried to help. Next, 62% who thought they were in a group with others when they heard the person choking tried to help. Now, Darlene Latane did many different variations of this study, and one of the main take-home findings that they found was that in all cases, as group size increased, the number of people trying to help decreased. In this experiment then, when the participants perceived that there were more people who heard the person choking, they were less likely to help. However, when the participant thought that they were the only one who heard the person choking, they were more likely to help. This demonstrates the basic principle that as group size increased, the number of people trying to help decreased.